And thanks for joining us tonight. Imagine you're charged with a crime, but instead of your case moving forward, it stalls for months. And the holdup, no attorney to represent you. Well, thousands of men and women across Wisconsin don't need to imagine. It's their reality, due in large part to overwhelmed and understaffed public defenders. Naomi Coles reports on the growing caseload crisis. I reported more than a year ago on growing concerns among attorneys and prosecutors that the pandemic jury trial shutdown was going to bring unmanageable backlogs. Unfortunately, those fears have become the everyday reality all over Wisconsin. It took 16 tries for Dante Wilson to get a public defender after the first had to leave his case. The Blake teenager is accused of killing another teen last Labor Day, and his case has barely begun. This case is not uncommon um, for the problem that is occurring right now all over the state. Janesville-based regional attorney manager Fawn Moses, a public defender of more than 10 years, says it's these kinds of cases that are the hardest to find lawyers for. Specifically for um, high-level felony cases, we don't have a lot of attorneys on our certification list to take those kinds of cases. So when we have those cases come to our office, it's a struggle to find attorneys to take those cases. It didn't used to be this way. Rural Wisconsin counties have typically struggled to hire and keep public defenders, but places like Madison and Milwaukee have historically been better equipped. Not anymore. The impact on the clients is huge. The state public defender's office told me their open cases have skyrocketed, specifically 32,000 pre-pandemic to 64,000 in May. During that time, the legislature has only given them one new position. So while their caseloads doubled by the thousands, they also went from 344 trial division attorney positions to 345. Keeping those positions filled, that's a story all its own. We're losing our attorneys and then those cases then have to be reassigned to someone else. So they're in the court system for even longer, making sure someone else is getting up to speed on those cases. When they can't take the cases, public defenders try to get private attorneys to help. They usually want to, but their own backlog is filling up. They wanna help us, they wanna help out, they wanna take our cases, but they are so overwhelmed. It's hard not to phrase this as a dire situation for basic constitutional rights of representation. Join me and Fawn Moses again this Sunday on For the Record, where I'll be airing our full conversation.